Rock Out in a Rainbow, a Francesca story. Our first real opportunity for public recognition had to be on a Saturday. I had to beg Georgia to let me have the day off. She wasn't too thrilled about having to spend her precious Saturday with her own daughter. Rich people suck. I'm off the hook, I said to Brie over the phone. She squealed, awesome. So how many songs are we doing? All of them? I called the event organizers to verify how long our set could be. Each band was allowed no longer than 15 minutes on stage. That allowed us time to perform at least three songs. Last Fest was less than two weeks away, so we didn't have much time to get our shit together. When the day arrived, I was shitting imaginary bricks. I don't think I've ever been so nervous in my life. Once we were out on stage, I mutated into a different person. My head was clear, my nerves were calm, and I felt invincible. The crowd cheered when I announced our band name as Jurassic 14. Todd and Axel came up with that name. Brie and I tried to come up with something less dorky, but I guess they were onto something. After the show, Todd and Axel sat in the back of the van, the triplets shared arguing about a rainbow. You are so full of shit, Axel said. Todd protested, I swear, I swear on, on the biggest pizza ever made that a chick in the audience was made of rainbow. Brie and I laughed our asses off. They kept it up the entire ride back to their house. When I got back to the Ellis' house, I was exhausted and excited. We were a little closer to the success that we all wanted more than anything. I was closer to being free of the gremlin.